writers, are you ready to write with me? Do you have something to write on and something to write with? Great. Today, we're going to use sentence stems to help us with our writing. Sentence stems are when we have some of the words already filled out and we need to work together to find the rest of the words. I'm going to need your help sounding out sounds and finding the right words to fill in our sentences. Let's get started. We have two sentences today. Our first sentence says, goods are things we blank or blank. Let's think back to our story that we read about goods and services. Goods are things we, hmm. What do you remember from the story? That's right. Goods are things that we want or need. We need to find the words want and need. Let's think about that word want first. Can you help me with that beginning sound in want? W want. What letter makes the w sound? What do you think? Did you say W? That's right. W says w. Do you see the word want? Can you point to it? Great. There's the word want. Good job, writers. Let's take the word want and put it in our first blank. Goods are things we want or need. Need is our second word. Let's think about the sounds in need. Can you stretch it out with me? N, E, D. There's three sounds in need. Hmm, what's the beginning sound in the word need? Need, N. What letter makes the N sound? Did you say N? That's right. Point to a word that begins with the letter N. Do you see it? That's right. There's the word need. N, E, D. Need. Let's put need in the next blank. Let's go to our next sentence. Our next sentence says, services are something you blank for blank. Hmm. Let's think back to our book. What did our book say about services? Do you remember? That's right. Services are something you do for someone. We need to find two words, do and someone. Let's search the words that we have left. The first word we need is the word do. Think about that word do. What letter does it start with? D. D. Do you know what letter makes that sound? That's right, it's D. Can you point to a word that begins with D? Is this it? No. Is this the word do? Yeah, there's the word do. Let's put it in our first blank. Services are something you do for someone. Our last word is someone. Let's think about that word, someone. That's a bigger word. We should clap the syllables. Ready? Some one. Two word parts or two syllables in the word someone. Do you see the word someone? Let's think about the beginning sound in someone. Some. Hmm. That's the letter S. Great. Point to a word that begins with S. Is this it? No. You're right. That word does begin with S, but it's too small to be the word someone. Someone is a larger word. This is the word so. Can you point to the word someone? There it is. Great job. Someone. All right. Nice work, readers and writers. This program is made possible in part by the Michigan Department of Education, the State of Michigan, and the W.K. Kellogg Foundation. Additional support by 
and by viewers like you. Thank you.